Ah, sorry. Hello, everybody. My name is Paul T. Williams. You can call me Paul. And, uh, we're doing the next level. The Lost City of Arcus, I believe. Alright, so this place must have a central palace or something. My guess is we'll find chaos there. Ready to go look for that crit? Let's do it. This is. This is kind of exciting. <laughs> it's my first visit to a Lost City. Well, I've been lost in cities before. But, well, you get the drift. Let's do this. Okay, the Lost City of Arcus. This is the semi-final level. So, this is the Lost City of Arcus. Although, now wouldn't it be the Bound City of Arcus? I'm betting the whole joint is filled with all sorts of weird and mysterious traps and dangers, the likes of which we've never ever seen. So, uh, you go search for the palace. I'm gonna go look into that, uh, city name change thing. Got it? Gotta go. Let's do this. Alright, new enemy. Alright, we've seen these guys before. If you've seen me doing the arena challenges. If not, uh, you, you hit these guys. And just wait a little bit. They'll start healing. So you just gotta be careful about that. And that's telling me to use Swarm, but I used them last time, so... Uh, thump back, you do it, and then we'll have Warnado go. Alright, thump back, you open, you open the way. And then we'll just have Warnado explore. Alright, as you can see, that guy makes bigger... Makes the, makes the pictures taller. All right, fine. We'll go back to Wrecking Ball. Jesus. You see, this is kind of why I, I want something sort of like a uh, name uh, character switcher. You know, that way I can switch between you know all the characters I need for the level without having to t take them off. All right, let's read it. Robot ball. It's about how I horribly crushed them. Robot ball was once a popular sport among Archeans. Their favorite part was that the robot balls themselves had the tendency to explode. Made for some exciting action on the field, but also led to many accidental explosions when these robot balls were used at home, which in turn led to property damage and the occasional reveal of hidden treasure stashes. I was, I was keep that in mind. All right, now we can continue on. Wrecking through. And, you know, in case you don't have a giant, there's a bomb right here. You can throw it over there. Alright, Thumpback, your, your turn to go. See, spin. Alright, you know, just kind of walk around. Of course, if you're done with that, you can just bounce up here. Alright, so we got this... I think it's a funnel hat? Okay. And we land back down. Now, fun thing, fun thing about giants is that uh, these things would hurt a normal Skylander, but uh, it's not big and strong. I'm actually going to switch over to Terrafin because it's Earth. 
It's for a good reason. Anyway, take this bomb. And you want to go over here. You fall down here. And is and here is an Archean robot. He will play with he will play at Sky Sons if you if you want to. I don't. All right, so stick and move. So you can fall down here, if you know, in this black hole, which, which is something I actually do kind of like. Secrets. Do the flop. All right, now there's our treasure, but but you know, we also got we also got another Luckatron wheel. Let's grab it. A wealth. All right, so continuing on. Now we have to push these blocks in there. I already messed it up. Push this. All right, so I guess the one fun shortcut that I that I sort of saw on like some streamers' uh, video, you can grab this bomb, and there's like an explosive over there. So what you're supposed so what you're supposed to do, and I'll explain later. But here's a quick here's something quick. You throw the bomb. That saves you a lot of time. You know, just saying. All right, so since since we're dealing with explosives, uh, let me just boomer you up. All right, I haven't used Boomer in a while, but you know, it's time to uh, blow stuff up. Ah, uh, yeah, I think I, you know, played as Ghost Rider, but I never discussed what I want for his Wow Pal or whatever. Ah, uh, time to go back. I don't know, I say just one from what I usually record. If you know what I record. Alright, here we have Chill. Ah, uh, looks like we got one Soul Gem left. Do you guys know who the last Soul Gem belongs to? Yeah, pretty fun character. But yeah, if I could go, if I could, I'm gonna discuss uh, Ghostbusters uh, Soul Gem. I think I would have liked it if. Now, hypothetically, oh, uh, I guess we got like a new enemy. That that's the uh, Archean Sniper. Yeah, these guys hurt on nightmare mode. Like they, they they deal like seven HP points. So if Wrecking Ball, if I was on Nightmare Mode and Wrecking Ball got hit, Wrecking Ball would die. Now, if I could say a Skyler that struggles with these things, I'd say it's Warnado. Like I like Warnado, but he he struggles with with these. It's just that you, you either need to uh, do a consistent number of damage, like a trigger happy or a sprocket that tanks or turrets, or you need to be like Wrecking Ball or Bash and just hit them really, really hard. But Wardano doesn't kind of have any of that. Also, Wardano has, has, tr has trouble dealing with the Archean Snipers. All right, we got the, we got the Napoleon hat, the bunny ears. 
I would like to demonstrate, but uh, I kind of killed them all. So, what do I mean that he has trouble? Uh, you know how he slides on the ground? I guess the developers never really... Alright, so, so just a simple push block puzzle in here. But I guess the developers thought that where the Arch Archean Sniper spawns, which is that little hole that they have, and the floor are like two separate objects or something. So, so Wardado doesn't get, even get the chance to uh, hurt him. So you have to probably rely on your shell slam to uh, get rid of them. Alright, and that's it for this uh, area. Alright, so please don't fall off the platform. But right now we don't have that upgrade. All right, so moving on. All right, so Terrafin's up. And here's our Locotron wheel. Okay, uh, right, right, back to Ghostbusters Wow Pow that I, I keep, I keep dodging. Uh, I think I would like if, if he could slam his chain in the ground and then rip it open, availing a bunch of ghosts. Oh yeah, it is possible to get, and yes, I have gone through that with just one character. Even a giant. It, it's just very precise. Alright, so we actually have two things that we can do here. Uh, I think I'm going to tackle this one. No, no, let's do the fire. Alright, flame slingers up. Alright, so in this fire area... Elemental area, we just gotta shoot these cannons. Throw a bomb over here. Fall down here. And... Hey guys, isn't it kinda weird that fight that we, that we see all three fire, evil fire minions in this game? Burn him alive. Oh no. I will not falter. We got one left. And that takes care of him. Uh, I think I, I think you should say I almost got careless. I declare this treasure mine. Great job. All right, so we just need to push this over. You know, I think this is like the, well, second to last fire thing that we can do with flame, fire area, that I can do with flame slinger. Oh, hey, wing sapphire. We need those, right? Great job. Uh, 
Ah, okay, we well, don't need to go up there. Hmm, just need to figure out a way to get over there, then we can, uh, blow it up. Uh, funny enough, if I remember correctly, Flamethrower is, like, used for, like, the, uh, speedruns in, like, Skylanders Giant speedruns, so... Okay, I see what I have to do. It's gotta be one of these. Stupid. I am not stuck, am I? Good. Alright, continuing on. Ah, shoot. I can make it. Made it. I think I can throw it over there. And we have one block we need to get rid of. Treasure in here. And I think this is an Adam hat. All right. All right. Uh, let's. Okay, you know what? Let's go in because I know that uh, Flashwing and uh, Terrafin have a lot of money, so. All right. Open up the present. Oh, sorry, Tress. See that? So fast. Outran, outran a spinning boulder. Uh, sorry. Oh. I would have egg on my face if, I, if that happened. Alright, so I'm not going to go back to Terra. Instead, I'm going to bring up Thump back. Because water is next. Wow. Alright, let's do this. Ah, shoot. You can't run! Alright, take out the sniper because I'm worried. He hits the hardest. Alright, uh, thump back, use either water gun or hydro pump, whatever you guys want to call this. I'm just gonna take out the I'm gonna take out the wizards. This will this will make everyone small. Hold on, I I can get them. Yes, you will. I like that he goes. Woo -hoo! Alright, let's do this. Alright, so... Now we have the big robotic ball. Hit him with the C-spin. Take a bite out of crime. Alright, I'll stop. Never. Never. 
All right, push this ball down. Now we just need. Where was that? We're actually uh, almost up at the level, to be honest. Not too worried. Over. I hate it when it gets like this because if he's because yeah, you, you step on the button, sometimes the ball will fall down, you gotta get off the button, you gotta get back on the button, and it lowers, then you push the ball, then you get back onto the button, so you raise it. I hate when that I hate when that happens. All right, so now, that, so that ball was supposed to destroy that wall, but since I already destroyed it earlier, all right, not too worried. You taste good. Put the bite on you. So why do I have this ball? So why do I need this ball here? Well, this thing does a lot of damage. If I can angle it right. I probably can't. You know what? Just fight normally. Okay, all right. I'm at, I'm at least gonna. I, I at least want to try it with the uh, with this robot. Excuse me, sir. Forget it. It's not gonna work. Great job, thumb back. Throw it. So you come down here, and this looks like our last chest, so I'm going to be extra careful because uh, I don't want to die. Look I, look, I learned in this playthrough that uh, if I show off, I, I lose. All right, just gonna look at my objectives. That is everything. All right, so we just need to go get over here. Attention, loyal minions. Tomorrow we begin our world domination. So be sure to go to bed early. All right. Now we just need to uh, push this over. Now all we gotta do is push that button, then we get, then we have to do the other side. Ah, uh, that was stupid. Push this over. And that's it. So all we gotta do is walk in, and then next chapter is gonna be the final chapter where we fight chaos. Not too long of a level, to be honest. Which is gonna be an easy speedrun challenge. Let's go 
in and take them out. Ah, you young folks, everything's rush, 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 isn't it? That's just what the clouds want. You rush right in all willy-nilly and before you know what's what, poof! He's right, you know. About the clouds? Really? You finally believe me about the clouds? Uh, no. It's just that stopping chaos isn't going to be easy. Go when you're ready, Skylander. Uh, give me a week to prepare. Or in this case, next Tuesday. Alright, so time... Well, I guess time to show off another character for the speedrun challenge. Unleash Air Statue Whirlwind. Alright, so, you know, Whirlwind, like all characters, uh, you can fly with her. So, she's part, of, she's part of the first characters in As Far As Adventure. First attack, you fire Alpha Rainbow. So, one thing I won't show off is that her Soul Gem, if you fire this Rainbow when you're, when you're in two-player mode at, at a second player, you actually heal them. So, you know, that's a pretty good thing to have. Whirlwind is able to heal other characters. Attention! Tonight there will be a robot musical about me and my awesome rise to power. All minions are ordered to attend. That is all. Come on, push this through. Alright, so jump up. Grab this. Now we can take. Now we can continue on. In fact, one thing I want to do first: grab this bomb. As always, while flying, your speed and defenses are increased. Uh, Whirlwind is like one of the first Air Skylers that my family owned. So, in a way, we sort. My family sort of got like almost all the Eons Elite first character Skylanders. We just didn't have Stealth Elf. Alright, her secondary attack is that you can launch these clouds. If you fire the cloud, fire out the clouds, they'll fire another stream of rainbows. But, uh, that, that, kind of, that kind of seems like a lot to set up. So what I like to do is I like to put the clouds in there, and they just deal damage. Alright, so, uh, this is how I usually get through. Just sort of like that, you just gotta hug the wall. Something else about the clouds is that if you press and hold it, it the clouds will keep going. So say, like, there's an enemy all the way across the room, you can just do that. And it will, it will actually reach it. Like this. The cloud's still going. So her wow pow is that if you fire the cloud and let go, it'll actually fire a rainbow. Alright, but there's also something else. If I do this, I can charge it up, release it, and out pops a black hole which does several amounts of damage. Uh, I actually do like it, though. Alright, just gotta wait. Alright, just gotta follow these guys. Uh, if I remember correctly, I think Whirlwind was like one of my sister's favorite Skylanders. So when I'm trying to get through an elemental gate, like an air, she's always like, no. Oh, don't mind me.
Man, Wormwood just hits hard. I know I got that uh, thing, but whatever. Hey, wasn't there supposed to be a rock here? Friendship power, friendship power. <laughs> Charge this up, fire it. All right, fly around. And just like with Spyro, you can actually do that do that uh, fly change thing that I do with Whirlwind. All right, not giving up. Don't give up. Alright, do a bit of 25. Alright. Eat rainbows. Uh, I think I kind of like Whirlwind series three a bit more though. Um uh, uh, uh wasn't there something I I'm supposed to be pushing? Oh wait, is this because I skipped the ball? It can I hold on, let me look at the objectives. Uh, I don't think there's enough time. Uh, I'm probably going to have to do this off screen, to be honest. Man. Wow. Come on. I think I glitched it. Wow. So, I think I'm just going to call it part right here and just get it off screen. But, I say it was a success since Warwind did technically make it to the end. So thank you all so much for watching. My name is Paul Anthony Williams. You can call me Paul, and I'll see you all again next time. Uh, have a good day, everybody.